Yo guys and welcome back to another episode of the Carter City Manager Career Mode on FIFA 23. Yes guys, we are at episode 7, so hopefully you guys are enjoying this series. Um, as you can see, we have Carney and we're going to put him into the starting lineup just because some players are um, a little bit low on fitness, so he's going to be put into the starting lineup for this game against QPR. So we have a chance here with Sawyer. Sawyer takes the shot and he scores to get us underway in this game. So seven minutes in, Sawyer has scored. He's managed to get a couple of goals, I think, in the recent episode. So I'm um, very good for him. Adam Yemi takes the shot. It wasn't a good shot whatsoever, and the goalkeeper calmly saves that. Sawyer takes another shot, doesn't go win. He gives it to um, Carney. Carney will shoot and he scores. So I don't know how many goals he has scored so far. I know he struggled. Um, Early on in the series, we're scoring goals, but I think he's doing a little bit better now. We have a chance here with Anthony Alanga. Uh, he takes the shot, gets saved by the keeper. We have a chance here with St. Justice. Oh, well, I was deciding to run with him, and then the defenders foul him. And, yeah, they do another tackle. I don't know how any of these won a yellow card. The referee kind of just gave them a warning, but I think one of them should have definitely been a yellow card. We have a chance here with Adam Yemi. Adam Yemi with a ball. He runs inside the defenders and he scores to make it 3-0 against QPR. So I don't think QPR are doing good whatsoever in this career mode. I think they're down at the bottom, but as you can see, we kind of give the ball away here. And then QPR shoot and they score. So yes, if you guys don't know, FIFA don't like me having a clean sheet. They always like the opponent score, so they score. And Yemi takes the shot, saved by the keeper again. We take another header with Perry NG. It gets taken off the line, but then Adam Yemi's there again to score. And he makes it 4 1 in this game against QPR. So, yes, um, that'll be one of the final plays of the game. I decided to, I'll put this in here. As you can see, they both decided to try and kick it mid air. Obviously, they got it away, but we obviously win the game. So, yes, I'm going to do a couple of training drills and I'll just let it play out for you guys. So guys, hopefully you guys liked that little bit of a training I put in. I decided I'll do it so they'll get a better rating. And Aston Villa have actually contacted and saying that we're not playing um, whoever that player was enough. And I decided I'll put him on the bench and I'll play him a little bit more. Um, just so there's no, um, so he doesn't have to be sent back. Even though I don't play him, um, I, I decided I'll try and play him a little bit and just see how he goes. Um, I'll probably put him in later in the match. But as you can see, Robinson has a chance to get saved. Um, so we are versing Millwall in this game, and this is a very big game since Millwall are third in the league, so if we're able to get a bit of a gap on them, that'll be good. And as you can see, we get off to a wonderful start, and who 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 else would it be to score a goal than Adam Yemi? Adam, Adam Yemi has scored another goal. This man is top of the league in goal scoring by far. Um, he scores, and we have a chance here with Wintel. Yeah, so he gets a goal. And yes, he puts us up 2-0 in this game. So very good from him. We have a chance here with, with Anthony Alanga. We try to give to Adam Yemi a bit too much of a pass. We're trying to get another shot. But there's the defender on the line. And yeah, they managed to clear it out. Um, Millwall on the attack here with Honeyman. Honeyman takes a shot. And he gets it in to make it 2-1 in this game. To Rails, to Robinson. Robinson will have a chance. Get saved by the keeper. And then they're able to clear that one out. We give it to Robinson, to Alanga, and there probably should have been a foul there. I, I'm not sure. Um, Adam Yemi with a chance here. He would take a shot. Very good save by the keeper. There, kind of throwing goal, and then we make a bad tackle with um, Kepre. And Kepre will get a yellow card for that tackle, um, as you can see in the top left right there. Um, we have a chance here with Rails. He plays a 
over the head through ball and Adam Yemi is able to get onto that um, pass the defender. He takes a shot, bounces off the crossbar and then Anthony Alanga is able to get that rebound. So he makes it 3-1 in this game and yeah, it looks like we will have a, um, a bit of a gap on Millwall on the table right now. As you guys know, a few episodes ago, we were probably about fourth in the league and now we're up top um, after a string of good performances and wins. Um, they have a chance here, they smack it right into our keeper and he saves it. We have a chance here, well, not really a chance, but Sawyer's with an amazing pass and then we give it to Capre with um, our center back taking a very good shot. Sawyer's will take a um, an interesting shot, but that is not a good shot whatsoever. Adam Yemi will take a shot, saved by the keeper. So as you can see, we're going to be playing um, that player and he will come on, see what he can do. He has a chance here, he will take a shot and he's not able to make anything of it. So we take a corner here, we take a header, Perrienji's header is saved off the, off the line and yeah that will be the end of the game and we're able to win this one 3-1. So as you can see and next game is against Newcastle, so yes this is in the Carabao Cup so this will be more of a difficult match since it is a Premier League club and as you can see they have a wood, um, Ismaili Saar is actually playing for them, um, Kieran Trippier is there so um, a bit of a more difficult team, we usually versus championship teams since we're in the championship but we're going to be versing a Premier League team so hopefully it'll go well and then um, our left back makes an, a, a very good tackle, um, Carney will have a chance here, he gets thrown on goal but they, get, but they get a tackle on him, Perry Engie somehow has the ball, he will take a very good shot but it's saved by the keeper Pope, um, Rails goes to Adam Yemi, Adam Yemi will take a shot and is able to score to make a 1-0 in the Carabao Cup. So yes, um, the Carabao Cup, so pretty much whoever wins goes through and the other team that loses, they get knocked out of the competition. Um, will Lock will take a shot, um, not too far away for them. We have a chance here with the Rails, he appears to be onside, he takes a shot and then the keeper gets a hand on it and, but it actually goes in the top uh, left corner or top right corner. Uh, we have the ball here, we plays an amazing through ball to a midfielder. He will pass it across to Anthony Alanga, so very unselfish play from him. Um, that's the type of players you want, you know, unselfish. And as you can see, Anthony Alanga scores. And a very good finish from him. We'll have another replay of it. Very unselfish and gives it to Alanga. And I'm pretty sure Adam Yemi was there. So he could have possibly scored there. And they actually score here. Um, I don't know what a keeper is doing. It seemed like a very um, slow shot. And yeah, I expect a lot better from the keeper. He shouldn't be letting that in. Uh, Ismaili Saar will take a shot and um, save by a keeper. Um, Isaac will have the ball, give it to Saar, and Saar shoots and it's saved by a keeper. They played into the middle there. Burns take a shot. He's not able to go into the goals. With the ball here was Adam Yemi. He would take a shot and it hits up the top left corner. So very unlucky from him. We have the ball here from a midfielder. He would take a shot. Very good shot. And I said a couple of episodes ago, our midfielders are not able to score, and our midfielders are scoring a lot of goals now. So, yeah, as you can see, we win this game, and now we get into play of the video. So guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe. That would be greatly appreciated. And yeah guys, if you have any suggestions on what you want me to do for the series, let me know down in the comments below. That would be greatly appreciated. And yeah, I'll be back with another video on the Carter City Manager career mode on FIFA 23. Peace out guys.
Driving off the stage in the crowd, it's a mosh pit. Yeah, shout it bad, but she broke and she don't own shit. Mama asked me, son, when the trap ain't gone quick. I've been riding around through the city in my new bitch. Yo, nigga, pop it with a pocket full of cottage. Hey, whoa, chemo, stop it, chop up.